Last week, Hey, okay, so your Friday. I'll look by report card. The year be too low. Jackie, what's it here? What so lost the lay with my bell at it here. Oh, yes, okay. For me, man, look at to share in share lay where Tom for me, man, look at man, look at hey, man, look at man, look at for me. Hey, 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 Mama, Mama Africa, Africa, your, your children, children are home. home. Um, thank you. Uh, if you're one of our subscribers, thank you so much for sharing, liking, and subscribing to our channel. Um, we appreciate you. If you're new to our channel, welcome, well, welcome. Don't forget, don't forget to subscribe as well as click the bell button to get notifications when we get new videos when we post new videos. And from the Pearl of Africa, um, watch our vlogs. Uh, share, like, and subscribe, and please watch the ads. Oh, please don't skip ads. At least watch at least five seconds of it. We appreciate it. So the kids are back. The kids are back home, and this is the end of the semester for them. So, so they have at least maybe is it maybe two or three weeks that they are off for the for the time. So we have to brace ourselves for that. So I went to the Nira for the uh, to finally tell them that. Um, no, 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 no. Actually, I had to go to URA and repay those money that I thought I would not, I would skip. I had to pay it just so I can um, get the birth certificate at Nera. So, which I did. I went to the birth certificate place because they turned me back. I said, mm -mm, you have to pay the foreigner fee. I'm like, but they told me at URA. They said, the baby was born here, so the baby is Uganda by birth. They said, no, they are misinformed. Go back there and tell them you have to pay in dollars. I'm like, oh, darn. But I had it. I, I thought I was about to go, but but I got it. They said come back on Monday to finally get the certificate of birth, and uh, that's what we need so that yeah, the U.S. government if we try to file for get the birth certificate or no 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 actually to get the passport, they would know that this is legit. Mm. So let me let me let me gist you guys. Let's 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 talk on some gist here. So you remember the, the, the restaurant, you've probably seen me do some, I said I'm working there and I, I've done some videos at the local restaurant in our town, small town here. And uh, so actually today we went there, we're just going back home now. We did um, some work there and all of a sudden we hear the trailer of my love from another land playing. <laughs> oh, whoa, no, they... And we look that way. I'm like, no, no, no. Pablo first looked. I was like, wait, that sounds like our trailer. And I didn't, I didn't hear it until I started hearing the song. Oh, whoa, yeah. no. And I looked, and they were looking at me. One, one of the ladies um, was showing it to this guy, and they, and he was in disbelief. He looked, he looked at the trailer. One of the waiters, yeah. <laughs> one of the waiters, and then he said, no, them, them, they were doing double take on us. Um. And I was laughing. We we're both laughing and. Yeah, and yeah, I've been there many several times. Mm -hmm. And the first time um, we showed on, um, we did a, the, the premiere tour, the, no, the media tour. And uh, this lady, I went back later on, this lady said, I saw you on TV. I'm like, are you sure you saw me? He's like, yes, I saw you. Were, you have like a movie coming out. I'm like, ah, okay, okay, that's me that you saw. <laughs> so ever since every, she's been telling people that that's us, <laughs> she will play trailers and stuff for them. Mm -hmm. And then all of a sudden they started watching our YouTube channel. And I started feeling somehow, I'm like, oh, no, 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 no. I want you to, I want people who are close by to not know who I am. Mm. I mean, I know it seems like we're like a local mini celebrity. Um, mm. We will see the TV, they are showing, you know, maybe um, episode of a TV show and all that on the movie, on mm. on the TV screen. And we're like, oh, I know these people. We know these people. Oh, yeah, we, we, we just saw them at Icon Awards. Oh, yeah, we talked to them and all that. Yeah, like so all the big, nice. big sitcoms and big, yeah. big, uh, what are those called? Like drama, drama, drama. episodes and mm -hmm. stuff. And um, TV shows. TV shows, yeah. yeah. So, and I'm like... Producers and stuff. We're like, oh, we know them. Yeah. We've eaten with them. Mm -hmm. yeah, we've talked to them before. I just, I don't, I... See, I don't want people who are near us here yeah. to know me, know me like that. <laughs> because...
because then you know because when I post a video on YouTube I would link it to my WhatsApp and then everyone in my contact will see it and all of a sudden like the tailor and... like the clothes seller at <laughs> the supermarkets and all of a sudden they're, they're sending me message oh don't worry it's all going to be okay we care about you oh we love you I'm like Eh? Who are you? I don't know. Like, I just I bought something from you the other I day. I just met you. Like, what oh, is this? And then you're like, oh, they just saw. They just saw a video. That some I very posted. personal video uh -huh. about. Yeah. And I'm like, oh, I, I would like to. And people who are close by that I actually mm. know to not know me like that, to not watch videos like that of me. It is kind of, it is kind of interesting. Because, yeah. yeah, you would be like, wait, like. I don't want people to see our videos. I'm like, but that's the whole point is, you know, to get the word out, to show people whatever, you know, what we're doing. Yeah, I want them to see the movie. And you're like, well, I, I want just, them to see it, but I just yeah, don't want them, to, these people, are like local people, people in our town, yeah. Because the other day, the guy, a guy approached us, oh, yes, I know you from Uganda Films. I'm a big fan. I'm like, uh -huh. so you've seen that movie. It's like, yes, it's, yeah, it's really good. I'm like, oh, somebody who actually... It's a I weird said, feeling, yeah. Um, yeah, at least um, I didn't know that it's person, shocking. so that's okay. Yeah, it's shocking. Well, if I knew them, I don't, I don't really want them to know mm. a lot of the YouTube video or even know that I did a movie. So I don't know. That's true. I guess, I guess it's because you, you want to like, if you're, if you were gonna tell them, you would tell them like right. in person. And it's weird that they find out other ways. But then it's like, wait, but if you're making these things public, if you are a public mm -hmm. figure, if mm -hmm. you are doing this. It's, it's, it's it. a tricky it's a tricky thing i don't know. know isn't isn't a princess princess she guys she's in the philippines now she's the one uh, who told me you said yeah some and soon enough you will be walking into a place and then people are going to be you know you'll be seeing eyes on you and then you will get mm. used to that thing i'm like i don't know if i can get used to, used that. to people being like hey look look there's yeah, that's so a, hey you know it's like know, yeah <laughs> like that's okay. I mean, it's okay in Kampala, but like in our town, mm, it's a small town. Yeah, it's like you don't want to be a celebrity in your own town. You, know, you just want to be like everyone be else. Yeah. You know? mm -hmm. And speaking of that, it's it's kind of interesting. I guess from my perspective, it's mm. you know it it is a bit weird, mm -hmm. but especially when it comes to like like people we worked with on the film, for example, we were just so busy. You know, it was like it was like. 5 a.m. to 10 p.m. every night work, work, work. We were just so busy. We had very little time to really get to know each other, talk mm -hmm. about each other. So, like, you know, they learned that, oh, I'm American. And they're like, oh, okay. And they basically, that's you know, all they need to that's know. all they need to know, right? <laughs> and so they, even to this day, they'll, they'll, they'll <laughs> like, you know, I get lots of, well, not lots. I get a few calls, you know, from mm -hmm. people for, like, uh, acting gigs and stuff. And I'm like, hey, sorry, you know, I got a family, baby on the way, things like that. And they're like, oh, okay, well, you can get, you know, get, you know, you can come and get one of your, uh, your, friends. Uh, your Muzungu friends, like another another American, whatever guy, and, mm -hmm. you know, come and act. And I'm like, I don't know any Americans. <laughs> like, we're out in a small town. Like, we're just trying to farm and stuff. We're just a family. Like, people, they don't really understand. Mm -hmm. um, and especially if they know, like, what we do. And, and yeah. they see, like, well, if they know a little bit, like, if they see, you know, the public side of us and they see, like, like you said, you know, on TV or, then or whatever. Then they we're, we are big or we, we've got some money or something. Right, they think we're big, they think we've got money. Mm. Or even just seeing me and the color of my skin, they think I'm big, got mm. money, all this kind of stuff. That I'm an investor. Because most people here, they're either investors, if they're, if they're from abroad, or if they look like me, they're either coming to invest, they're either an NGO, or they're part of a, what is it, a religious, like, ministry... Mm outreach mm -hmm. stuff like that uh, missionaries or whatever and either way there's always funding behind them right always funding behind them or they're very wealthy tourists oh, so yeah. right because like Gosh. to be a tourist you know you to, to come here money. exactly you have to have money to be able to do this like for us we go to what, some of these major parks and stuff and or if we were, look into it it's like and they were saying each of us will have to pay maybe a hundred fifty or a hundred dollars per person Mine was like ninety dollars or something crazy like that. They well, always up the price. Like 50. Yeah. I'm like, wait, what if I use my Nigerian passport? I said, yeah, you're still, you're still considered foreigner. So right. I'm like, wow, I'm done. No. Yeah. Mm -hmm. it's, it's very expensive if if you're a foreigner. So I'm mm -hmm. like, well, you'll just have to wait ten years or whatever once we become <laughs> citizens. You know. Then we'll go for free. Then we'll go for free or for very cheap. You mm -hmm. know, because yeah. we can't afford this. Mm -hmm. 
but but it's weird for people to you know see that and even here like uh in our garden or whatever you know if i'm working in the garden someone walks by and they need they need work and they're like hey you know can i you got some jobs for me or whatever i'm like hey i don't really have money to to pay you but uh maybe a little here and there but right now i'm just trying to do most of it myself you know stuff like that and they don't really get it <laughs> and they're like, what? I'm like, even me, I'm looking for work. You know, I'm trying to find work. But, but, okay, okay. They're I, like, I, I don't get I, it. Are you realizing that we are living that movie? That that's our yes. reality? <laughs> yes. Oh, this is So real. the character of Shegun in My Love from Another Land is very much like that. <laughs> so, uh... So yeah, if you haven't seen the movie, yeah. you'll get to see a lot of our life in there. It's so, but, um, it's so real. Yeah, we used it's... our experiences when we were writing that story, but um, oh my gosh. but yeah, no, it was it was uh, uh, it's just it's interesting because yeah, people they see me in particular, you know, or they hear you, they hear your accent, oh, and they think money, yes. you know, they think money. They think, yeah, they increase the price yeah. on me. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And I have to tell them like one, but the thing is like. Once, once I explain to them, hey, we're actually an immigrant family. Do you know what that means? You know, and they're like, uh, sometimes they know. Mm. Other times I'll explain and I'll say, like, you know, if a Ugandan family wants to go to, you know, UAE or UK or the US, any of these other U's out there, you know, uh, they end up, you know, they'll sell everything, right? They sell their business, they sell their house, they sell whatever land they have, they send, sell their goods and they, and they, they emigrate, right? They leave Uganda. I was like, that's the same thing with us, you know, we left everything, we sold everything, and we came here. I'm like, so, yeah, we've only got what we've got with us, that's it, like, there's no funding behind us, we have nothing behind us, you know, it's just us. And uh, once they understand that, and they see us as an immigrant family, then their attitude changes, and usually it changes for the better. Um, there are some that change for the worse, like, once they realize you don't have money, like, backing funding whatever they're like oh and then they just kind of walk away or leave you <laughs> uh, but those are very few uh, most of them um actually become even more friendly and they're like oh wow yeah and then they actually start teaching you they start helping you out and stuff like that and it's great you know so we've had a lot of na- neighbors like that who've, who've actually helped us a lot so like i've i've learned a lot from a gentleman who's been helping me in the garden here he's been teaching me a lot of things um, but yeah, it's, it's really good. But yeah, it's it's something we have to explain, you know, like this is who we are. We're not what you think we are. We're not your typical foreigners coming here. And they also think, yeah, you're coming here for like, how long are you going to be here? Like a week, a few months, a year, something oh, like that. Yeah, I remember that the yeah. last him in that. So you are. When so when are you traveling? going back? Yeah. I think we're good to Nigeria. So, so you're going for good. You, you're not coming. Back. No, no, we're staying. We stay here permanently. Mm. Like we're just going there to, uh, to visit. Like, Oh, and then, then when you come back here, then you go. How many we're like, no. no. No, we're here to stay. That they couldn't understand. That. Right. Like, why are you staying here? <laughs> I guess there's not that many people immigrating here. <laughs> but, uh, but yeah, this is us. Yeah. This is us. We are a bit unique. But uh, this is what we, we enjoy. <laughs> yeah, we are finally home now. So let's go in. Mm-hmm. I think it's... Oh, no, it's not time for nap yet. It's time for lunch. Almost so we'll, nap time. Yeah, we will go and eat and we will go and... Oh, they're opening, they're about to start opening the gate. Oh, God, oh okay, these so kids, good. they're learning how to open the gate yeah. on their own. Okay, that was too late. We better get going. Yeah, Anyways. Right. Thank you guys for watching. <laughs> well, we'll catch you in the next vlog until next time. Like, share, subscribe, and we'll see you in the next vlog. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Ciao. Oh.